back in the oven it goes. Whew, that heat felt good. So coming from the ice cube truck, the charger for some reason went off and the battery was all the way down to zero and everything went off because it's got those systems on there where it turns everything off. So it was pretty darn cold in there. So Stephen, I just uploaded a video maybe about 30 minutes ago um, to our channel that actually I had recorded almost two weeks ago, but I now got it up. It's about our channel growing and evolving and about us selling that first Peterbilt. I mean, I just uploaded the video and it's getting a lot of views. Um, so do you want to say anything about our channel growing um, and changing? Do you want to add anything to how, you know, we're, we're not into the motorcycles like we thought we were going to be, but we're back? No, nah, ladies and gentlemen. So first off, uh, I've been owner-operator for the last 17 years, and uh, I had bought three Peterbilts. And uh, that last Peterbilt, I had over $200,000 wrapped up between the brand new trader uh, Mac trader from the factory that nobody's ever pulled but me and that Peterbilt had a rebuilt motor in it and then I rebuilt the truck itself as an 05 Peterbilt and uh, it's a beautiful truck once they got it all done and I had no plans of getting rid of it but uh, we have a um, special needs child that was in a boys home and they had no, uh, they didn't want to send him home. So, and it was, uh, he had attacked his mom twice. And so I made the decision to uh, sell the truck and tractor. I mean, the trailer, truck and trailer in order to uh, start another business called Big Belly Rebuilds and uh, building Harleys. And, and uh, staying home and getting our boy back and uh, having a life here. And then the election happened and uh, I got to thinking and evaluating things and I was like, people aren't gonna be buying Harleys. And uh, so at that time we had uh, already gotten our child back. And so I decided I better get to doing what I know how to do and make money to support my family. So I found this guy that had been trucking since the 60s and was having eye problems. And his truck that, you know, an owner operator since the 60s knew how to take care of his truck. He had a personal truck that he didn't want to get rid of, but I talked him out of it and bought his truck and trailer. And uh, since then, uh, we started the channel with the with the Big Belly Rebuilds coming into existence. But it changed to me going back into trucking. And uh, that's been, what, two years now? Two years so, in April. And y'all have uh, been a, on the journey with us. And two years later, uh, two years later, trucking is really bad. Freight rates are is the worst I've ever seen them. And obviously everything else is outrageous and inflation has hit and so it's uh not hardly getting out and making much money on the road um just you know it's all about paying the bills i'm not making enough money to do my maintenance or anything so and uh that's not the way you run a business you just run it into the ground so uh, uh the channel has been growing pretty good um it could do better, I'm sure. I'm not sure what we're lacking. We don't have any content, uh, per se. We're not building anything with our hands. Uh, I'd like to be able to do that. I'm always working on the truck. In fact, I gotta take the whole front of the motor apart, refix it to fix an oil, oil leak, but I'm not gonna do that in these conditions. It's not that big of an emergency. I can just pour another quart of oil in it, so. Um, but anyway, the biggest issues we're having right now is freight rate is really, really low. And uh, so that's about all I've got to say with the... But what about make people making comments? 
You want to talk about that? Uh, yeah, and comments do help the channel grow uh, as far as YouTube is going a uh, concern. Uh, as YouTube is concerned, they really look at comments and uh, more than they do thumbs up and thumbs down, but they help as well. But comments really help you grow. So if you have any questions or any comments, please leave them down below. They help us grow. <laughs> that rhymes too. <laughs> leave them, help it. You said leave them below. That helps us grow. That's, That's right. Leave your comments down below because they help us grow. All right. God bless. Have a wonderful day. Waiting on this duck to come out of the oven. I've never cooked a duck before, so uh, it's all experimental. Um, so we'll see. That looked pretty raw. I don't want no raw duck. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>